Hi everyone, welcome back to TS Talk Sport. Hope you're all doing well. In this one, I'm just talking about Ainsley Maitland Niles. Now we know, you know, he's been in and around the squad now for quite a few years, surprisingly. You know, he came into the side, you know, under Arsene Wenger, um, played a couple games, uh, mainly at left wing back. Um, since then, you know, he's predominantly played for us as a right back. Um, he's had a couple chances in central midfield, which he hasn't really, you know, proved to be the best place for him to play. Although, you know, that is his natural position per se. And, you know, he just hasn't been able to to convince any manager that this is the position that he should play in. Now, the latest reports is that Arteta is willing to sell him in the summer. And uh, it's not really a big shock to me. You know, he was one of the key players involved when Arteta first came in. Then he was dropped out of nowhere when we went to Chelsea away. And he hasn't been able to find himself back into the team since. Um, and yeah, it's an odd one. You know, what will happen with Bellerin in the summer? Who knows? Um, you know, we've got Cedric Suarez on loan. You know, who becomes a free agent in the summer? Um, for me, we'll probably end up signing him in the summer. Um, probably put him on a one or two year deal. And then it's like, who else can we have at right back? Is the plan to go with Bellerin and Cedric Suarez? Is the plan to bring someone in? And, you know, for Maitland now, he, he just doesn't seem to be able to get into that midfield. Um, I saw him play one game in, in there. I think it was a Europa League game. And, you know, he was dreadful. I think he got hooked off at half time. And, yeah, for me, it, it's not surprising. The reports are that teams like AC Milan are interested in him. And, you know, we probably can command a decent transfer fee for him. You know, he's still got um quite a bit of time left on his current contract. So I'm sure we we could get a decent amount of money for him. You know, no offence, but he's not a a thirty thirty five million pound player. But we probably can come on something around the fifteen million pound mark, maybe even twenty, uh, if we're lucky. And and yeah, you know, only time will tell what will happen with him. Um, you know, for me, um, I would like to see him get more opportunities in the midfield. But at the same time, when he's played there, he hasn't been able to to nail down the spot and. The way we've been really bad this season, if you're not able to nail down a sport in, in this current team, in your preferred position, and you don't knuckle down well and, you know, take the right-back position into your, into your own, then you kind of leave yourself with no hope. So, yeah, um, that's the reports that, you know, he could be he's, he could be sold this summer. And, yeah, it doesn't surprise me. Only time will tell. But I'd be glad to get your thoughts on it in the comment section below. And if you haven't already done so, go hit that subscribe button now. And I'll catch you next time.